Hey guys, welcome to Let's Play Resident Evil 6. With me today is... Fenrir's Dark Seal. I actually haven't said my name in a very long time. <laughs> uh, Wade and I are going to be doing a co-op of this game. We're going to see how well the internet goes with this, too, because I've tried actually doing online stuff with, like, Lester and stuff like that. Mm. But we'll see. But anyways, let's go ahead and... Uh, start the game here uh right before we did anything we uh wade and i had the custody of deleting our save file so we get a fresh start so that way we won't have all our stuff at the beginning of the game essentially yeah but anyways uh wade send the invites please all right just let me hit new game here we are starting with leon's story we're going to go in order leon chris jake and then ada mm-hmm uh, difficulty we will set on Veteran, because while we both have played and beaten this game, we haven't, uh, played it in quite a while. Yeah. Um, actually, let me go and see if I can, yeah, just send the invite when you got it all set up, alright? Alright, uh, Leon or Helena? Um, which one would you like to be? It doesn't really matter. Uh, Leon and Helena share equipment. Like, they both have the wing shooter. So, it, it's really up to you. I can play as either. Okay. Uh, how about we do this, then? I'll be Leon for Leon's story. I'll be Piers for Chris's story. I'll be Jake for Jake's story. And um, I'll Agent be the nine. UB Ada for Ada's story. Alright. So, Helena... Does that work out? Yeah. Okay. Sounds good. All right, folks, we managed to actually get it to work this time. So, without further ado, let's start the game now. The, game. the germ. <laughs> we skipped the intro prelude part because all it is is like intro to commands and shit, and that's easy enough. We'll be seeing it later in this story anyway, so. Yeah, same event. So, yeah, cutscene time. Bioorganic weapons are a global threat. Start working with the rest of the world. We have to come to my desire to appeal to you. It might create more problems than it's time to take responsibility. We want to have any chance. I've always valued your friendship, Leon. Stay right where you are. Mr. President! Cathedral. I'll explain everything there, Agent Kennedy. How do you know my name? Yes. Hunnigan. Thank God you're both all right. How do you two know each other? That's Helena Harper. She's been with the Secret Service since last year. I can't tell you how good it is to hear you two are all right. Look, I hate to rush introductions, but I need a report on your situation. Just shot the president. What he had already been infected by the time we found him. Leon. Leon did what he had to. He saved my life. God help us. All right. I'll submit the report. You two just focus on getting the hell out of there. The virus has already spread three miles past the campus perimeter and it's not slowing down. You need to hurry. Not before we check out Talok's cathedral. Agent Kennedy's got a lead that might tell us who's responsible for this. Leon, is that true? Yeah. 
I think I might have something. Roger that. I'll map out the safest access route. Keep your radio on. I got a lead? You will if you come with me. So Helena's existence is kind of an Easter egg in and of itself in this game because a lot of people don't realize she was actually in Outbreak File 2. Just a little nugget of information. Yeah, just a little nugget. Of <laughs> <laughs> Where did she come from? Actually, she was a Resident Evil veteran five years, six years before six, something like that. Now, and one thing that they really do, like, Adam, I don't sorry. understand why, like, I understand in certain so situations, but why is shooting the president at this point a bad thing? It's hard to explain. Still. If I don't tell you what the cathedral, you know, you may not believe me. They make it um, seem like Leon just assassinated the president. Well, the I, fact of the matter is, like, there aren't exactly any exceptions to any rules when it comes cathedral. to killing the president yeah. of the United States. Yeah. There's Except no except when he's that. already dead. But the only evidence is Helena. Here too. The only one to back him up is Helena. On paper, fair. he just shot the president. I mean, they can kind of look at the autopsy and see that he's, you know, a zombie. Who would be left to look at the autopsy at this point? Ah, <laughs> uh, true. Anyways, Who would be there um, to conduct the autopsy? It's not working. <laughs> I can see it's not working. Dumb bitch. Now, um... Chapter 1-1. Oh. One, one, um... Uh, Resident Evil 4 and 5 cut up the chapters into segments like chapter 1, 2, 1, 3, 1, 4. Resident Evil 6, on the other hand, kind of meshes all the chapters into one coherent thing. And that having been said, 1-1 one, one is really, really boring. Yeah, there's not really much action going on here. This is just to set the mood, and honestly, I have to say, Leon's story this is, is still probably my favorite. They'd all be here eating dinner right I now. can see why. I mean, like, all the scary aspects of 4, they're still here, you know, so. in Leon's story. Well, the only time it was nighttime in 4, it wasn't really scary. It's just like Raccoon. That's true. The entire beginning of 4 was in the day. You were one of the survivors. Up until, like, chapter yeah. 2, 3, I Never think, it turned night. We're going to this cathedral of yours. So, like, everyone's like, oh, 4 is like the most amazing Resident Evil ever because it broke so much ground. It fixed the control scheme. And that's what it did. <laughs> yeah. It fixed the control scheme. They didn't make it tank controls. <laughs> well, you know, or truck controls, I should say. Alright, now we have access to Ron, finally. No, this is just like moving normal speed. We've been crawling. We still can't sprint. Yeah. Whee. So we have to go and chase that mysterious figure throughout the dining room. Oh, and we can draw our guns now. Um, Helena and Leon both... Wait, do I... When you aim, like... Yeah? Does it show you the triangle thing for your wing shooter? Yeah. Do I not have the wing shooter? I don't think you do. Helena doesn't have the wing shooter. I'm sorry, man. That's annoying. Um, Helena does get a shotgun called the Hydra. In the back. Oh, she gets a Hydra? Yeah. Compared to the regular yeah, the riot gun shooter. that Leon gets? Her, her uh, shotgun's really good because it's a, practically a triple barrel shotgun. So, like, not everyone shares equipment. This will be my first time even seeing Helena's gear. Yeah. I was I always under the impression she shared wing shooter with Leon. No. She gets a shotgun called the Hydra. It practically, like, kills things really fast. As shotguns tend to do. Are you alright? The fog. I know that, uh... The fog. Piers gets a special sniper away. rifle. Sherry gets... A, like, a... Wait, let me go. It's too dangerous. An electric stick or something like that, a stun rod. Mm-hmm. My daughter... She's all alone. If we don't do something, Everyone seems to have their own little thing. Mm -hmm. I think the Agent 9 has like the TMP from Resident Evil 4, so he has like a large capacity assault rifle. Yeah. 
Or in the TMP cases, TMP's case, it's a right. submachine it's gun. Mm -hmm. Leon, we don't have time We're to. making the time. All right, so we're going to help this guy find his daughter. Are you? Even though now we're kind of really no, nope, now we're fine. Just when we get so close to behind him, we slow down. Move faster, bitch! I also switched my laser color to green because. Also, anyone who says I didn't get them the first time, shut up. Like you, you didn't drew get your what gun the first on that time? shit. The uh, panel falling. Oh. <laughs> that was kind of like, I'm so used to the like, stuff falling and like, they try to make a d dynamic like, scene on that. I'm like, well, that wasn't really that scary. <laughs> well, the entire thing is like, there's this huge party here on this campus and you've seen one undead the entire time. And that was the president. And you cutscene plugged him in the head. So where are all these people? God, Mr. Dad Guy, move faster or I'll fucking shoot you in the back. <laughs> um, one thing this game did kind of get away with is, uh, situational melee. Smash. Oh yeah, if you push R1 without aiming, you can actually melee attack. Leon has kick, I think Helena just pistol whips. And kicks, okay. Yeah, she... She does it all. I do think so, we have uh, friendly fire off, but I'm not sure. Um, yeah, there's no Claire detection. So we don't, like, whack. <laughs> oh, yeah, so we don't just end up whacking each other, like so. Um, friendly fire was never a thing. It was just player reaction where the player would yeah, react. Stun back a little bit to the kick. Shots or kicks. Um, up here, though, is a first aid spray. Up here where Wade went. Yep. Already got it. Wonder how much oh, I need to get one. These corpses are on their feet. Oh, um, I will I say oh, that just... the emblems, which is the collectibles in this game, I don't think we're going to go and get, try and out of our way to get. I mean, if we see one, we'll shoot one, but. Speaking of seeing one, hold on. That's not one? Okay. No. Yeah, her gun is a lot different, I have to say. There's a lot less recoil on hers than the wing shooter had. Yeah, the, uh... When you try doing the Hydra, though, it's a pretty awesome weapon. I like Helena's, uh... I like playing as Helena just because of that. Probably should have chose her, but... I don't know. You all right? I haven't played Leon in a while. I will be once I find my daughter. Uh, one thing they also added is dodging. I called her help, but... They pretty much made it as user-friendly as humanly possible. Somewhere. And everyone wants to complain, and it's like, oh, there's no scary factor to it anymore. No, but it's still fun to play. And I'm sorry, but the regenerators in this game are a pain in the ass. <laughs> um, I The best way I can describe the control we scheme of this game, um, if any of you guys was, uh, played Gears of War, that's what the kind of... It's, control scheme, I can Thank really you. say it. They got That's the dodging man right. maneuvers and everything. Liz? You Liz, go into cover and stuff like that. Oh yeah, I forgot he has... Does this guy even have a name? I don't think so. We know his daughter's name. Liz, yeah. But, don't know this guy's name. Exit. It wouldn't be that easy, would it? I don't know if my controls are kind of inverted with camera. No, uh, it's the same I've always done. No, it isn't. I didn't know if they, like, defaulted it to invert camera controls. Not that I've ever noticed. No. They didn't. I just... Careful. Not Blood thinking hand. I got your back, yo. Oh, you're waiting for me. I have to wait. Yeah, you have to go to the door. <laughs> oh, one thing they also did is they allowed you to switch hands with your gun. Yeah. I think you just... Yeah, just... R3. Tap in the right stick. Yeah, R3. So... Hello. God, it'd be so easy to blow you the fuck away right now. I wonder if it even let you. 
like shoot at her. I didn't try though. <laughs> Girl with a bloody face turns the corner. Yeah, I'd probably shoot her right in the face. Like, I don't care who you are. Just like bloody face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this Hydra? <laughs> oh, this is your daughter. Okay. <gasps> well, she's kind of dead now. <laughs> the Picador, the Picador, and the Hydra. How do we get out I do have place? the Hydra already. Yeah. That Hydra, you'll the like it. Trust me. The elevator is up ahead. Dead ass. Hopefully it still works. Dead ass. That college ass right there. <laughs> you know all about the college ass, don't you, Matthew? Oh, yeah, because I just graduated college, so, yeah. I graduated to gas That college ass. That college ass. Hydra ass, man. Um, I should probably explain the HUD. So, the big white squa squares are our health. Um, it doesn't necessarily mean one hit per block of health, like per white block, it but if you, like, lose half of a white block, like, if you lose half of it and you wait a second, it will come back. But if you lose that block, it's gone until you heal. The healing button is R2, and you need herb. Herb's pretty much, like, smashed into caps to, uh, heal. Yeah, they're used to really revive people, uh, revive your partner, too, in case they're down. Yeah. And, um, the number, which is zero next to our white health squares, are the amount of healings we have. One heal per square. And action time. Time to do elevator action time. I like how they actually turn off the flashlights because it isn't necessary. <laughs> this is a kind of duh okay, situation. Listen. You're going to be okay. <laughs> We're almost there. I have to say, they made a very badass virus in this game. Yeah. This guy's expression, though. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, it's a really depressing moment. If you gave a shit. And then you're kind of like, oh shit, what do we expect? And then the lights go out. And you're like, fuck. <laughs> We are screwed! <laughs> Checkpoint. And you can still kind of see, sort of. Picturesque. Look at that face. Okay, so I gotta go in. Quick time sure. event. I already did, right in the side of the neck. Don't you bitch at me. Okay. Shot her in the back. And boom. Could have saved you ammo, just bash her brains in with a pistol. But I, I, I hit the melee so button. You hit the melee we'll button. I guess I meleeed her. That is kind of weird. Us, and they don't hesitate. Why did this have to happen? But yes, both the dad and the daughter are dead. We'll never see that dad again. Like I said before, he kind of where the hadn't... fuck is he? Right no, there he, in front of you. Friend. Grab your gun. Okay. Consider my gun grabbed, Leon. Don't let him in. Hello, zombies. There's quite a few things they've done to kind of increase your playability here. Yeah, they kind of put you in a closed space there. Kind of hard to maneuver a little bit. And no ammo. Um, generally, it's safer to go around these guys, but we need ammo, so... Tripping. Bam! Goes nuts, son. Oh shit. Off me? Bam! Roundhouse In kick. the face. As I as I finish the fight. Roadhouse. Roadhouse. Come on, I stomped on you. Fuck down. Push the button, game.
Try you also have limited. Oh, there's oh. actually ammo right there. Okay, that worked out. Mm. I think you can share ammo in this game. Can you? Um, I think the ammo we pick up isn't hey, specific what? to us. Like, if there's ammo, like you picked up that ammo, I picked up that ammo too. That's our cue. Yeah. To get the hell like, out I can pick it up. I couldn't agree more. Yeah, kind of want to waste a hydro shell though. Hold on, let me go find a fool. I want a fool. Come here, foo. No foos? Okay. Come on. Back on the picador. So that was 1-1. One, one. No kidding. Most that was boring one. thing ever. That was the tutorial level, essentially. Even though they already had it. Setting the world. stage. I wouldn't stand there and yell like assholes in a camera that maybe no one is looking at. <laughs> they have no idea! Just... Toasties. Also, your friend's getting lunchable. Leon, it's too late. <laughs> There's nothing we can yeah, it really is too late. What was he gonna do? Just run in there and be like teleport? I would have seen the foot shuffle on camera and be like, "Okay, we need to we need to go get that guy <laughs> <laughs> before he's a stupid." You're right. But no, he became a stupid. Let's get the hell out of here. Yeah.